this video <coughs> playing as John Marston Man, is this thing w I said, Abe, yes, where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to full, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Oh, no, the whole no. full beginners. Horses. I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest Duncan? He will insist on riding <coughs> Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. Come on, he's over here. I'm good. You get on. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Since you showed up. Runaway horse has been to some of our problems, and I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck, you... Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all, hmm? Maybe I could have handled them. <laughs> of course you could. <laughs> They're just loud mouths. Yeah. So, uh... Is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something? Well... When Mr. Geddes goes into town, well, it ain't exactly for, uh, business. Oh. Uh, okay then. All right. He'll be just at the end there. Well, I better get two. Thanks, kid. Okay. I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. Need a hand with that horse? No. Whoa. <laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. Pretty big one. That's Jeremiah. Okay, Jeremiah. There, boy. Hey. You done? Come on. <laughs> Come on. Easy, boy. Oh, someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? Oh, calm down. He likes you. I ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I'm supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. <laughs> That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. We're okay. Let me ride him a bit first. Get some of the spunk out of him. I think okay. that might be I'll good. Wait in the <sighs> All right. So, uh, uh. Deplete Jeremiah's stamina. Calm him. Calm him enough. Yeah, boy. Yeah. 
Yeah, Jeremiah. Come on. Let it all. Got some energy? Show me then. Just run. Come on. Where's that big mean horse? Just riding all across the. Um. Oh, yard here. Oh, oh land. I guess. A oh, piece of land. Piece of land. Oh no! <laughs> oh, stupid me! There you are. You're all right. Okay. That was fun. You're all right, Jeremiah. Behave now, can't you? <coughs> He's all right. Go to Duncan and let him ride, Jeremiah. I don't get in trouble for maybe uh, uh, sort of uh, damaging the horse there, but maybe. Going on a little tumble. Who's a good boy? No, oh, right. He's ready for you. Okay. Get on up there. Go nice and slow. Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. The heart's beating a little. Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. <coughs> Not that I'm saying you need one, but you sure there isn't another horse for you to ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? You think my son could borrow one? Huh. Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in bit trouble bit from all these Laramie boys? Um, they say Mr. Abel's real rich, way richer than Pa, um, and he's got all these hired bit. guns out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Yeah, but... but... Just worry about the horse, yeah? Yes, sir. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now. Both of you.
Okay. You Mr. Milton? I thought you were gonna help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my husband. Thank you, Mr. Milton. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. So, you know much about birthing a foal, Milton? Not too much. Oh my God, where does my husband find men like you? Bill, we all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. It's not too hard, you just to stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Whatever you say, ma'am. I think she's... Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah. We we have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around? Oh, uh, I'm I'm busy. Uh, t too busy for social calls. Of course. Good day, Mr. Milton. <laughs> she was uh here planning on trying to get Marston in the sack or something trying to hit on him but Marston's having none of it John. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. So, this is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on. Please. For me. For him. How's he been? kind of withdrawn quiet you know sure take him out please come on boy let's go for a walk come on To the left. What do you see? The pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Let's go, girl. Let's go. How you doing? 
fine. Can we go home? No. You're... Stay calm. Just Where would you like out. to go ride? Aside from home. You're not going home. But maybe that stream. Good idea. And you know all this. Get him going. Come on. You know. The horse can feel your fear. Just act confident. Okay? Uh-huh. Confident. Yep. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. Well, don't. Mm -hmm. Now let's go. Jack, mm -hmm. a little kick and a. Well, maybe I'll run into the tree there. Speed it up again. Okay. Come on. Ah. Pull him in. You're in control of this. Easy. so bad sir good amazing what the right horse and a little confidence can do let's bring up the pace again all right Rain him in now. Show him who you are. Whoa! How do I look? Better than before. Keep at it. No, they're similar bit. Um, a similar bit like this in uh, in the uh, in the original Red Dead. I mean, uh, I rem um, I remember there's a bit with him, uh, John there. and Jack riding so. together. Uh, I well, I guess so. Probably similar to this. See, you can do it. How about you speed up a mic? Okay. Okay. Let's go across to the stream. Yes, sir. Losing him a little bit there. Whoa. Here we are. Yep. We should get back. You think you're ready for a little race? I guess. All right. We go back to the path and up to the ranch. Okay. On my go. Go! 
Oh, we're racing. Be flying like Hey, come back here. You'll have to catch me. <laughs> oh. It's gonna win. I beat you. I beat you. I well beat ridden, son. <sighs> I beat you. Like I said, your riding has gotten so much better. Thanks. Hey, keep practicing your riding. You too. You need it. Old habits. Investigate the disturbance. Rev um off here. your mouth boy you will be the first one we kill leave him alone <laughs> oh careful boys careful yeah. look at this tough guy get out of here how oh, fancy parents get he's paying you to be tough for him huh <laughs> <laughs> no he's paying me to keep the place clean oh. so he had some problems with vermin oh listen to this Real funny. <laughs> no! Oh, oh, come on, get him! Come on, get him. Uh oh. Oh, kick his head in, Bob! Probably isn't. It's Why? Getty spins on women. Oh. He says it's on hands. He's fine to stay. It's because you're tough. It's because you're stupid. Um, oh, he's trying to hide who he really is. First. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in a brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. <laughs> Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And you, boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. Yeah, we'll be yeah. back. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. You stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Now, dear, I won't hear any more of it. You won't hear any of it. 
not in front of the men. You toad. All right, smile, smile. Do not embarrass me. Oh, is that only these things I can do? Yeah, yeah. Mm. Hey, I wonder can I... Mm. Yeah, yeah. Mr. Milton, I should like to have a word with you. Mil Mr. Geddes? No, uh, no, we the had another incident we with the uh, Laramie the boys. Yeah, there was an incident. Well, I mean to scare me. Are you scared? A little. I've got a lot invested in this place, and, and not just the land, but, but my family. It's, uh, it's hard to explain. I understand. I'll do my best to keep you safe, sir. Yeah. I know you will. So how's your family? Uh, just fine. I should probably head back. <laughs> yeah, I know how it is. <laughs> How'd you get on? Okay, I guess. Better? Sure, I'm just tired. I know. Anybody want some more? Hmm. Uh, no, no, I'm thank good. You. I miss Mr. Pearson. John Marston, you're such a pig. <laughs> 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 it's all right, it's getting late. Let's get some rest. Good night, Jack. Good night, Mama. Good night, Jack. Good night, Pa. Who oh, no. knows? What, what are you? What are you doing? My job, Abigail. Lock this door behind me. Don't open it unless you know it's me. Uh oh. -uh. Oh shoot. Rich man's fault. You boys are over. The cattle are ours. And soon enough, I'm trying to keep it. Oh, God. Who's this? New hand. Keep them coming. You know that offer? It just went down. He's out. They've killed Mr. Tobert, and they've stolen my goddamn cattle. You men okay? I think so. Yeah. Jim Milton saved my life. It's Mr. Abel. Yeah, of course, it's Mr. Abel. I can't believe he thinks it can scare me out of here. Then I guess we're getting your cattle back, I sir. guess we are. Can you go too, Tom? Of course, sir. All right, Jim, I know you can handle yourself. A little. Go get your guns and head out. Guns? Oh, don't play coy with me, son. We need your help. I don't care what you used to do or what your 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 name is. This is the land of second chances. Understood. Okay. Come in, it's me. What was it? Mr. Getty's cattle was taken. God, I'm sorry to hear that. What are you doing in that thing? Mr. Getty's been real good to us. We I What are you doing? My job, Abigail. My goddamn job. I'll lead the way. This is gonna be the last we hear out of them. Yeah, yeah, right. Your horse is here. We'll be better on foot. Okay, if you say so. That's the place up ahead. There's our cows. A couple Ooh. guards out front. A couple more out of sight, I imagine. <gasps> Let's get a closer look. Let's go. Yeah, 
There's plenty of guards. I'm gonna head straight in. Yep. Tom, you head up there and try and give us some cover. Abe, you're gonna try and flank the place and come in from the back. I'll give you a minute or two, then I'm heading in. Yes, sir. Okay. Hey! Hey! You boys been coming up to Pronghorn? I thought I'd come down here. You're all so tough. Come have a Oh shit. Oh well. coming up to pronghorn I thought I'd come down here you're all so tough come have a word with me you here to come no uh -huh. Oh, don't blow up, yo.
fat guy? Ah, uh, I thought it was a monitor. Shot my feet up. I got this. You boys take cattle. See you back there, son. Old habit die. So talky now, are you? Pit digging, pit shoveling, backwoods, sack up, no good, trash. That woman of yours got the look of a woman ain't had a real ride in her life. She's got to make do with some piss poor stinking farmhand. Hey, hey, tell her I'll let her in my sheets. As long as she bathes first in sheet dip, get the stink of you off of her, farmhand! Um. Uh, uh. Oh, well, um, oh. Okay, gonna pull the trigger anyway. Pull that though. 
get some looting in. Be a good girl now. Oh, nice. Uh, Dog in the sky. I thought that m there might be a choice on whether to kill, shoot him or not, but <coughs> wind up shoot you wind up shooting him anyway, so. I was going to try not to kill him, but... Hey, you're back! You did real well, Mr. Milton. This man can really fight. Saved the whole place. Ah, uh, <laughs> that weren't nothing. Well... You! Oh, you! <laughs> you saved my... No need to say nothing, sir. Just doing my job. <sighs> now, I don't think they'll be back tonight, but... How about, Abe? Just in case you stay up. Yep. See anything or hear anything, you fire that rifle three times. Three times. We'll all come running. Will do. Uh, well said. And thank you, Mr. Milton. Truly. Just glad to be of service, sir. <laughs> I understand. You get some rest. Thank you, Mr. Geddes. What? What? What choice did I have? Just answer me that. What was I supposed to do? Supposed to be. Not be two people at once. That's all I'm saying. Jimmy, mad game. Uh, I just wanna look see here. I wonder if I can do it. All the remaining things I can do. Uh, can I do them? Do I do them as John Morton or do I go back to playing Arthur? Even, well, though he's dead. But, you know. <laughs> No, no, I'm sure I'd probably end up playing, going back to Arthur once I, once I, I finish the epilogue Surviving. and Sick. carry on with any. Here, I'll get you some coffee. One thing I know how to do is, or what not? No, Undertakers like me, cattle, not so much. That ain't true. I ain't no rancher. Rustled horses, not raised them. Stole cattle, not birthed them. I was, I was reading the newspaper. I was reading about a old ranch, Beecher's Hope, down by Blackwater. Was you? Well, Jack read it to me, but I thought maybe we could raise some money. Bank could lend us the rest. We could be happy, John. We Bank could... loans? I got a goddamn price on my head, woman. I know. I know all about that. Every time we about to get somewhere, make something, you go and show the entire world that you ain't Jimmy Milton. Every place we've been has been the same. We start doing mm -hmm. okay and then boom, 
You act like the big man with the gun. No. Tired, John, and I guess I was dreaming a little. At least give me that. Just feels hopeless. Hmm. I'm doing better. Milton. Milton, ma'am. Mr. Geddes needs you to head over to Strawberry in the wagon and collect some mail for him at the post office. Sure. I'll take the boy with me. He's getting soft. Lance a lot. Come on. Jim, if you're heading that way, can you pick up a parcel for me? A dress I ordered. I think it's in your name. My name. I think so. One's in your name and the other one's in mine. O only one should have come in by now. How much shopping you done? Oh, yes, a real keen purchaser of goods, me. Look at me. <laughs> okay, Lancelot. We'll make a man out of you yet. Not too much of a man, mine. He's only a boy. Just gonna show him how to drive the wagon a little. We'll save the real exciting realities of adulthood for another day. Come on, get. You take care now. Of course. <laughs> it's nice getting out of the house, huh? I like being in the house, Pa. I think just about doing things you like, boy. What happened the other night with those men? Did you kill them? I did what I had to do to protect you. Ma said it was pride or something. Your Ma was wrong about that. What do I do? Well, just hold them and pull them short to slow down. Tell them to go faster. Give them a little switch. And then hold them one side if you want to turn. Here, try it out. Enough? For now. Back in Strawberry, eh, kid? Looks like. You know, I think this is the longest I've seen you without a book in your hand. It was foolish to forget mine, sir. Look, I got some business to attend to with the clerk. I leave you with the wagon. Can I trust you not to drive off with it? Oh, I think I can be trusted to that. Very good. You giving the horse a rest, Pa? You rock, oh. asshole! We ever gonna get to Strawberry going like this? All right, here we are. You all right, son? Sure. Well, cheer up a little. Wait here. I won't be long. Okay. Mm -hmm. And if you behave, I might let you drive us home. Can't wait. Hi. I'm here. Name? To... My name? Uh, Jim Milton. Jim Milton. Hmm. Um. Nope. Mm. Nothing here. This could be. Uh, yeah. Maybe try. Marston. John Marston. It's a long story. Okay. John Marston. Marston. Uh oh. Nope. Nothing here for that name either. 
Try Abigail Roberts. Hmm? Abigail Roberts. Abigail Roberts. Hmm. Yes, here we are. And also, I'm here to pick up the deliveries for Pronghorn Ranch. David Getty sent me. Pronghorn? Yes, er, uh, oh, er, uh, sign here. We have a bunch of stuff for you. <sighs> and I will help you out. I'll take these. You get the rest of the stuff. Here, let me help you with this, Mr. Marston. Uh, it's, uh, mostly Milton these days. It's a long story. Whatever you say, Mr. Milton. It's not important. Take care now. Give my regards to Gettys. Thank you very much, mister. Okay. Let's get out of here. 